Hello, I'm happy to join you today via video for the Women's Cancer Conference. I wish I could be there in person. I look forward to seeing you on my next visit to Saudi Arabia. And I also look forward to visiting the King Abdul Aziz University, Sheikh Mohammed Hussein Al Modi Center of Excellence in Breast Cancer. Your important work is saving the lives of women across Saudi Arabia. Thank you to His Royal Highness, Prince Khaled Al Faisal, Governor of Makkah Region. Thank you to His Excellency, Professor Osama Sadiq Tayeb, President of the University, for supporting the conference. And thank you to Sheikh Mohammed Hussein Al Omodi for sponsoring the conference. Your commitment to the Center of Excellence enables needed research and supports critical efforts to save women's lives. I especially want to thank Dr. Samia Alamodi for her incredible work and for her courage to speak about her personal battle with breast cancer. Her willingness to talk about her own experience has saved the lives of women throughout Saudi Arabia. Thank you, Dr. Samia, for organizing this important conference and for hosting the Middle East Partnership Initiative meeting. The seeds of this historic partnership were planted in Saudi Arabia. In 2005, in Qasim, a representative from the United States State Department met with members of the King Abdul Aziz Women's Association. At that meeting, as the women talked about their breast cancer awareness program, they saw the similarities between their program and our initiatives in the United States like the Susan G. Komen for the Cure. The women began to plan for a real exchange of breast cancer resources and discoveries between the United States and the Middle East. I remember with great affection my trip to Saudi Arabia in October 2007, where I announced the United States Middle East Partnership for Breast Cancer Awareness and Research. Since the announcement of this partnership, the United States and Saudi Arabia, along with other countries from the Middle East, have partnered to institute awareness campaigns and share discoveries and data that will lead to world-class research. Over the next quarter century, an estimated 25 million women around the world will be diagnosed with breast cancer. Breast cancer does not respect national boundaries, which is why people from every country must share their knowledge, resources, and experience to protect women from this disease. The cure for breast cancer may come from a researcher in Dallas or a doctor in Jeddah. Wherever the cure is discovered, women the world over will benefit. Thank you for raising awareness of breast cancer, and thank you especially for your commitment to save women's lives. I send my very best wishes.